Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Bowman Draft Baseball Asia Edition. 12 box random team break number four. The Asia Edition checklist is basically the same, except these uh, those are the exclusive parallels, that pattern right there. That's what we're, that's what we're looking for, those Mojo Refractors. Um, no paper ships, as, as you would expect from our draft breaks, except for these key guys, Kirkstad, Heston Kirkstad, Zach Veen, Spencer Torkelson, Robert Hassel, and Jason Dominguez. Paper donated to charity. Big thanks to this group of people right here. Nick Stober's all about it. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. Congrats again to the winners in that filler break. Always look out for those filler breaks on jazbeescasebreaks.com. And there are all the teams right there. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Names and teams, six and a three, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And ninth and final time. After nine, we got Joe Drobeck all the way down to Kyle Cook. After nine. Six and a three, nine times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, six, there's six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine, we got the Dodgers. Got my Dodgers down to the Nationals. All right, now trades are allowed. We'll, we'll have a little trade window going. But trade at your own risk. Joe with the Dodgers. Mark with the Marlins. Nick uh, with the... Wasn't there a NASCAR driver? Is that Mark Marlin? Mark Martin? Mark Martin. Maybe it was Mark Martin. Sterling Marlin? Sterling Marlin? Sterling Marlin. That's what I was thinking of. Nick Stober with the Reds. Jason with the Indians. Andrew with the Padres. Travis with the M's. Greg with the Royals. Nick with the Astros. Andrew with the Angels. Joe with the Tigers. Arthur with the Cubs. Nick with the Rangers and Rockies. Ron with the Red Sox. Israel with the Brewers. Nick with the uh, White Sox. Sky with my rivals, the Giants. Martin with the O's. Andy with the Mets. Kim, you got the A's. Ryan Redman with the Blue Jays. Wade with the Diamondbacks. Nick Stober, Twins, Rays, Yankees. Joshua Cherry with the Braves. John Samuelson with the Phillies. Nick K with the Pirates and Cardinals. And Kyle Cook with the Washington Nationals. All right, so let's get all this on one screen. Let's sort by column B. And Martin is saying he would trade He would trade the Orioles for the right team. All right, we're going to pause. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Then we'll have the break. Stick around. All right, welcome back, folks. A lot of trade chatter, but no deals were done in this break. Random team number four, Asia edition. There you have it. Let's roll. Sorry, Israel. Trade window is closed. Make sure you're not lagging behind, folks. Otherwise, you may miss some trade offers or trade trade deals. I think both both King and Israel may be lagging behind. as is John Samuelson. All right, yeah, both, both, both King and John Samuelson. Brad saying, King is saying deal, but we closed the trade window two minutes before that. It's in, it's in the chat. Sorry guys, too late. Don't lag behind folks, otherwise you miss those tr you miss those trades.
roll. Right, so the paper doesn't ship, so I'm going to set paper over here. All of this chrome, of course, will ship. And these are the exclusives to this set right here. More paper here. Got some color coming up here. What do we got? It's Trent Palmer, Blue Wave autograph, 57 out of 150. We got the Blue Jays for Redmond. Ryan Redmond with that one. There you go. There's our first. Kirkstad paper for the O's. Martin with that one. And we got Jack Blomgren. Out of four ninety nine, some paper right here. Paper. This is our first Zach Veen paper for Nick Stober and the Rockies. And an Oswald Peraza, blue chrome to 150, Yankees, Nick Stober. Another paper, Zach Veen. And a Heston Kirkstad autograph for Martin. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. It's a little, it's a little uh, bent, a little, or kind of bowing a little bit. But maybe this toddler will help kind of straighten it out. But there you go, second overall pick for the Orioles. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo, strikes again. And there's our first paper, Torkelson. Let's keep that right there. That's the number one overall pick. That was the first couple boxes. Here's another couple boxes here. I know, I do too, Mark. I love this break as well. <laughs> you wish you had Nick Stover money. Well, hey, listen, if you, I don't know what you do, but if you keep working at what you do, you'll get there. I'm sure of it.
Uh, Giaccio, LA Live. Uh, how do you qualify the game on the mosaic break? Yes, precisely. Yeah, read the read the instructions. They're in the description. But yeah, you gotta have at least two. Basically, an even number of teams. All the details in the item description. Draken, what's going on? CJ, what was looking like four times speed? All right, another two boxes. Let's go. It'll be cool to see one of the big names in these exclusive mojo patterns right there, refractors. It'll be pretty nice. There's another Kirkstad right here. This car's a little bent here in the middle of the pack. It's kind of weird. All right, and we've got Adam Seminaris to 4.99 Angels. Andrew Webb with the Halos and a Kirkstad paper for Martin. And the autograph is Patrick Bailey. 174 out of 250, purple chrome autograph going to Sky and the Giants. Last spot mojo strikes again. 60% of the time, last spot mojo hits 100% of the time. Zach Veen paper for Colorado. Nick Stover, Rockies. I think that's our first paper, Robert Hassel, going to Andrew and the Friars. San Diego. Our first paper, Jason Dominguez. And Miguel Amaya for the Cubs. Blue paper to 150. Arthur King with the Cubbies. And there's Jason Dominguez right here. That is for the Yankees, Nick. And our autograph is Holden Powell. 466 out of 499 refractor autograph for Kyle Cook and the Nationals. Mojo, 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 refractors. Vaughn. Set that there. And 
and it's another two box in the books. I think these speckles also, speckles, sparkles, are also not as common as some of the other cards. This is uh, for Nick and the White Sox. Looks like USC is cruising. How's everyone's brackets looking? Mine is terrible. <laughs> Although I did have USC in it. I, I, I think I, uh, I guess I was feeling very optimistic because I think I, I fell in love with too many, uh, too many upsets. And there were a lot of upsets. I just picked the wrong ones. <laughs> I picked the wrong upsets. I thought, yeah, there's gonna be, there should be a lot of upsets. Alas, wrong upsets were selected. Bracket is pretty much. I have, I still have my final four intact. So that's helpful. But my margin of error has grown very, very small, very narrow. Use some extra powerful glue at the factory here on this one. like Drake is out of the tournament. Let's see. What game are we watching here? What's on? TBS has a game active here. We got Iowa maybe? Yeah, Grand Canyon. Grand Canyon in the uh, tournament. I think they, they, they might get smoked by, oh, I don't know. Could they beat Iowa? Maybe. Yeah, I saw that too. I put a little bit on the other side of that. Yeah, Gonzaga favored by like 33. I mean, they could do I mean, they could do it. They could probably win that game. I don't know. 80 to 50, 80 to 40, I guess what would the what would the score have to be for them to cover? I mean, it'd have to, it'd have to be a real blowout. There's Daxton Fulton for the Marlins. Mark with the Marlins. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. There's a Chrome Torkelson this time for Joe, M, and the Tigers. Yeah, maybe 80 to 47 would have to be, because that I means Gonzaga could score 80 points pretty easily, right? Noah, welcome. Welcome to being live in the stream. Always make sure you're live, folks. <laughs> Noah was 17 minutes behind. You happy with your team? What do you? What, what, what team do you have? All right. More coffee. A little more cards. Coffee and cards. Is that? Is that? Is that? Is that a show? I know there's comedians and cars getting coffee, with a. Uh, with Jerry Seinfeld, but is that a is that a future podcast? Cards and coffee. 
we invite some some collectors maybe you invite some collectors to hang out and talk about talk about cards over coffee 46 out of 50 Reed Detmers for the Halos Andrew with the Angels It'd be a good show Mark you'd watch or listen yeah it may, maybe it'd be a show unless you want to hear a slurping coffee <laughs> Maybe it works better as better as TV. There's another Kirkstad for Martin and the Orioles. Yeah, we've we've got a card bar out in our shop. We can sit at a corner, enjoy some coffee, or maybe go to a nice coffee shop now that things are slowly starting to reopen again. Sit at a coffee shop, rip some packs, talk about the hobby. Coffee and cards. Cards and coffee. Coffee and cards. Cards and coffee sounds better. There's Alric Soler to 99. Green paper for the Twins. It's like 15 out of 99 for Minnesota. Nick. Yeah, mix up. I agree. Gonzaga not covering seems to be a good bet, but I don't know. Vegas makes money for a reason. So there must be a reason why that line is set that way. <laughs> you know, I don't have like a I don't have like a, a computer model crunching out numbers. You know, and punching out results. Uh, Daniel Cabrera. Zach Veen for Colorado, Nick, and then there's another Heston Kirkstad for Nick Sub. And a Mojo, Zach Veen, that's pretty nice. And an Addison Coffee and a Chris McMahon. So all sorts of things happening here. So there's Addison Coffee to 250 for the White Sox, Nick Stober. Here's our first Mojo Refractor, Zach Veen for the Rockies, Nick Stober. And there's our autograph, Chris McMahon, also for the Rockies and for Nick. There you go. Nice, nice set right here. All right. And x-rays negative on LeBron's turned ankle. That's good. That is good. Hopefully nothing too serious. Maybe that'll force the force the Lakers to give that guy a game or two off, out of a, out of an abundance of caution. All right, another two boxes, and we've got four more to go. An MRI is pending. All right. Well, hopefully it'll be hopefully it won't be any anything terrible. Man, I've been struggling with these packs today. How long has Grand Canyon University even been around? <laughs> I feel like they just appeared as a college like 10 years ago. Now they got a basketball team in the tournament, 15 seed. When's my alma mater, UC San Diego, when, when are they going to get into the tournament? Well, San Diego State has been in 
in no, numerous times. They were bounced last night, but they, they've been in numerous times. I think UC San Diego may still be in Division Two. All right, yeah, McSub saying Huskies sucked all year, and their biggest loss was was 29. But I don't know. I've I've been I've been burned by Vegas enough to know that sometimes if it's too good to be true, it's probably too good to be true. There's Spencer Torkelson for Joe and the Tigers. Actually, let's top load that number one overall pick. Established 1949. I just thought it was more recent. I mean, I was joking about 10 years, but I thought it was like maybe 80s or 90s. But 1949 is when they were established, which is kind of, still kind of new for a, for a university. But Hollywood saying Tim Salmon went to Grand Canyon? They got some sporting history there? There's Perdomo to 250, purple paper for Arizona, Wade, with that one. And there's Logan Hoffman. That will be for Pirates. That's going to go to Nick. Nick K. this time. Different Nick. On the board. And this is for the Angels. Andrew. Biggest loss you can find in the so far in the tournament has been 31. Interesting. Well, there's Jason Dominguez for the Yankees. That'll be for Nick Stover. I already put a little bit of coffee money on on the other, on the plus thirty three. So I'm hoping it'll happen. <laughs> Robert Hassel is Saul, uh, Saul Garza, that is. I don't know what I was doing there. I think I was maybe going going the Raul pronunciation, and I was going to go Saul with that. But, but I'm going to go with Saul. I think that's a little bit easier. 63 out of 150, Blue Wave autograph for Greg and the Royals. Saul for you. There's Zach Veen and a paper Torkelson for the Tigers. Joe M with Spencer. There you go, Joe. All those Torkelsons that we've been pulling. Rockies, it's going to be Nick S. And all those Colorado players here. There's a nice Jason Dominguez mojo. There we go. That's what we're looking for. That's the picture on the break. It's just the base parallel. I think there may be different parallels. Maybe Robert Hassel. Are there? Maybe not. Is this the one we're looking for? Is this the picture? This is the picture, right? This is the picture. The picture looks a little sky, sky bluish, but maybe that's just the way the picture was taken. But nice Jason Dominguez Mojo Refractor. These Mojo Refractors are exclusive to the uh, to this uh, Asia edition, and that'll be for Nick Silver and the Yankees. Congrats!
All right. Hey, TJ, what's going on? Yeah, Rob, you can just go to ESPN. They've got they've got uh, under their NCAA. I think it says M NCAA M section. It would be a drop down that has scores on the tournament. You can search by date. Although now I'm now you're making me curious. I wonder if there's a site that has that can where you can easily see all results of every tournament. Where would that where would that be? Maybe ESPN does have an archive of that by year. Maybe basketball reference? Do they would they include college? How about Oral Roberts, TJ? Yeah, a little closer to us. Yeah, talk of the town, right? You know, I kind of, I had actually kind of blanked where Oral Roberts was, and I was like, wait a second, I think, and then I realized, it's like, was it Texas? Was it? And I was like, no, it's in Oklahoma. And I looked it up and I was like, right, it's in Tulsa. And I was like, and that's been I was saying yesterday, boy, TJ must be pretty happy. The town must be thrilled. Yeah. What a big win. I actually I actually had them uh, advancing in that game, so I was pretty happy. The rest of my bracket is garbage, but but at least Oral Roberts made me happy. Didn't realize until last night that Oral Roberts leads the nation in free throw percentage. Oh. Very disciplined. All right. Two boxes here, another two back there, and then we're done. Probably about another... 15, 20 minutes or so. Thanks for hanging with me throughout this break, folks. Appreciate it. Keep those fingers crossed if you haven't gotten anything just yet. There's another paper Torkelson for Joe and the Tigers. We've got some green right here. Gerard Encarnacion. Out of 99, that goes to the Marlins. Mark with the Marlins. Oh, no. TJ. We'll have to find another hat for you. I think we have more on the website. Someone now has a Jaspie's hat. Maybe that someone will, uh, will discover us, pop into the chat, and be like, hey... I found a hat with your logo in Colorado. And we'll be like, yeah, we know who it belongs to. Send it to TJ. That'd be a nice little story. There's Jordan Balazovic to 250 purple paper for the Twins. Make sure that hat gets to you, TJ. There's Evan Carter, refractor autograph to four ninety nine, for Nick Stober and the Rangers. True, most likely the cleaning crew has it, but you know, cleaning crew could have could have kids who are into watching group breaks on the YouTube. They might stumble upon us. There's a uh, Zach Veen for the Rockies, Nick Stover, and a Mojo Spencer Torkelson. Nice, Mojo, Mojo, Jojo. 
You guys remember Mojo Jojo? It's Joe M with the Tigers. There you go. Rebel, Rebel's got it. The Powerpuff Girls battling the evil Mojo Jojo. Mojo Jojo. Paper Dominguez. <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty fun show. A paper Robert Hassel. And we've got blue paper Brett Beatty to four ninety nine. Drake, what's up? You have a box of essentials coming to the store for Canadian. eBay already wants two fifty. You hate price place on cart. Um, it's better than the other way around, I think. Let's you know that there's a lot of value in those Inception boxes. It means it's good. It means they're selling well on the secondary market. Imagine if it went the other way. Not good. Not good on the secondary market. You know, and I'm selling. Then I'm in. I end up selling Vet Commons underneath the bridge, just to get by. because no one's buying boxes that have junk in them. <laughs> There's another Hessen Kirkstad for the O's. And the final two boxes coming up. automatically advances because because VCU under COVID protocols and whatnot wow so Oregon just moves on well, I hope everyone's okay but You know, Draken, we also, uh, Jaspies also has a personal box channel website as well. So group breaks are on jaspiescasebreaks.com, and jaspies.com has personal boxes, so you may be able to find, I don't know if we have Inception, but I think, I guess for future releases, you may be able to find some, some boxes there. They're, they almost always come from fresh cases, too. We can open them for you live on Instagram Live. At Jaspi's breaks, or we can, uh, or we can ship them to you sealed. Right, there's the 
Chrome. Another Chrome Spencer Torkelson. Nice. Joe with the Tigers. Yes, Holmes. I think Gonzaga is favored by far. Gonzaga and Baylor, I think, are the are the runaway favorites to win the whole thing. I think they were at like a two two to one, two and a half to one or something like that. But the odds were pretty low, and I think I think Baylor was right around there too. Yeah, no worries, Drake. Maybe you'll find something. I don't. Again, I don't know if we have Inception, but right now, but maybe you'll find something else you like. No, I didn't, Adam. I just heard the news too. That was crazy. That I I did have Oregon. That's kind of good for Oregon. They can get a get a little extra rest. Hopefully, they don't. You know, they stay disciplined. Make sure they don't fall under protocols. But but it looks like they're automatically going to be playing whoever wins this Iowa GCU game right here that I'm watching. Pretty wild. All right, there's Spencer Strider, 250 purple paper for the Braves, Joshua. And we, ooh, this is a nice blue wave, Ed Howard. For, uh, for Arthur King and the Cubs. Nice. What did he try to trade this? May try to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. One seventeen out of one fifty. Blue Wave autograph. Supposed to be a pretty big prospect for the Cubs. Sixteenth overall pick. There you go. That's a nice one. Where do I have? Um, oh, you have Oregon upsetting Iowa in the next, as, did, as do I. I have Oregon meeting USC. I have USC winning to face Gonzaga. USC to lose to Gonzaga. Is Joe Boyle to 499? Right, he actually had yeah, traded too late, didn't trade Mojo. Even. King dodged a bullet there. Could have been disaster, Arthur. Paper Dominguez. Almost done, folks. I think today is going a little bit better than yesterday, although I did have Santa Barbara. Winning a couple games and they they are out. Oh, Bonaventure was the one that screwed me today. I had I had Bonaventure and them winning a couple games. Another big game for me. I think UConn is going to be a big game for me. I have Connecticut going going pretty far to the eight elite eight. I think so. As long as those teams are intact, I may have an outside shot of having a decent bracket. Evan Carter. Rangers, Nick Stober. This might be our last autograph of the break. We'll do a quick little recap at the end, too. There's some paper. There's Quinn Cotton for the Reds. That'll be for Nick Stober. Some more Chrome, Robert Hassel. Some Mojo Jojos. I all, I too have a Ohio over Virginia, Maryland beating UConn tonight. I don't I do not want that to happen. <laughs> yeah, I mean I think Virginia has barely had any playing time, right? They missed. They may be pretty rusty. I think they only flew into Indiana. Recently, rel relatively recently, not too much practice. Didn't play in a conference tournament. That opens the door for Ohio. 
Not the Ohio State University, other Ohio. To maybe pull off the win there. All right. So that was 12 box, random team four of 2020 Bowman Draft Baseball Asia Edition, which has the the exclusive Mojo Refractors, which are really nice. That Torkelson was nice. The Dominguez Refractor was nice. That's the picture of the product on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Some nice auto. We start Heston Hurstad, Kirkstad autograph. Heston Kirkstad autograph was pretty nice. And guess what? We have more draft. Asia edition. So if you missed out on the first time or if you didn't have a very good break, um, there'll be another opportunity to try. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.